Well, let's wander over to the protein complex. Um, but on a side note, I wandered over to a pork fest this weekend in Couts, Indiana, population of 1,500. And I can tell you, if anything is as good as the pork that we had on Saturday with no clouds in the sky, 75 degrees and a nice cold beer, it was fantastic. So in Couts, Indiana, population 1,500, kind of in the middle of the state, uh, things look pretty good as far as, or at least tasty as far as the pork goes, uh, anecdotally. Um, Again, the funds long around 30,000 contracts last week. They're voting with their feet. That sounds like the bean market, right? We've got maybe a bullish story in, uh, in lean hogs now as of just like we might have be building a bullish story in beans. So again, 30,000 contracts, they're still <clears throat> kind of beef, uh, beefing up, wrong word, but hanging in there to the story that maybe something will come out of it. now. Uh, we were getting close. We almost set some new lows here a few days ago. We had a nice spike higher, so we've got some breathing room. But we were flirting with some decent lows in, in, in hogs, and now we've come back a little bit. Nice spike up yesterday. Uh, the market's kind of consolidating. Keep that in mind, but we still do have a little bit of a buffer between where we're trading now and the, the old lows. That's going to be something that I'm going to have to keep watching because if the market doesn't get any new bullish news, that could see the market slowly but surely trade to those levels. And then lastly, again, it's, it's, it's a lot like soybeans, the fact that when there is still maybe a story here um, and the tweets or what can be said by one government or not, that's going to be something that's going to still play heavily here. And I think really that's why you've got the funds still kind of holding in there. And we're, we're only going to know two or three weeks from now whether this was the time to buy if we've been carving out a low here. Only time will tell. But this is a critical level where we're going to have to start really paying attention to what type of fundamental news is coming out of whomever, whether it's a tweet or something that the government gives us, because this is going to be the point that we're going to look back on and say, hey, this is where we began this move. So keep that in mind. Lots to talk about there, lots to keep your eye on. We'll see how we get on with the next couple of weeks.